Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Greg M here on the go with your sports report. Just want to cover a race that I didn't quite fin finish on um, with my commentary. I was trying to make so many different comments. I forgot to kind of come back to the guy in this race here. Let's see the Tobago. And you see the time that he ran, right? Of course, congrats to Christian Coleman with the world lead. He's sharing the world lead time with Noah Lyles. Right, and um, Daniel Hughes from Great Britain. But Tobogo, right, you see what happened to him. This is what, this is what can happen as a consequence of a long season. Sometimes it's due to fatigue and tiredness, the muscle is just worn out. You know what I'm saying? And um, this young man here just didn't, um, didn't quite make it all the way through let me come out of this here let's see the Tobago right down here is this little dot we're in a 10 6 1 and as I watch the race again I'm gonna put a, 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 a link at the end of the video in the video card where you see where he kind of pulled up it looked like he pulled up halfway through the race or right about 60 meters you know he came out in his dry phase was looking good but this is a consequence when you have a long season. Even though he's a young man, a young man can still strain his muscle or pull from just being overworked. You know, I don't know what caused it for him if he just had a poor warm up or he's just the muscle. Hey, when your body says it's tired and the muscles can't take it anymore, that's it. It just it's gonna end up suffering a strain. So you have to listen to your body. Yeah, I don't know if he felt a little tight before he went out during the race, but was expecting him to do better than this, so you can forget about him being in the 200 meters and you know it's kind of sad to see that he finished his season with an injury but he has a whole year to recover so it's probably not going to take him long six weeks is what he will need to recover and then you know he's going to start back over with his strength work anyway and conditioning so you know he has a chance to come back he's still had a good season he has a chance now to focus on the olympics but recover so let's hope that today Sunday the 17th of September we'll, we'll have some good competition, nobody get injured and they can look forward to next year with some confidence and get their minds ready for the Olympics. But watch this race here, I'm going to put it up. Right, Please like, share and subscribe if you like what I'm doing so the algorithms can spread my channel around and get me some recognition. All right, But watch to the end and I'll put the clip, you'll see the clip of the 100 meter race. And you can tell me how that looked to you. But you know, you can see he hopped all the way in the last 40 meters. So, unfortunate for the young man. All right. That's it. We're going to stay tuned. Sure, o'clock this evening, all time. The, the Sunday event, we're on World Record Watch with Sharika Jackson. We'll see if she'll get some help from the win and finish out our season healthy with a double win with the Diamond League at Oregon. All right. So, Watch this race, the 100 meter, you can see, let's see the Tobago, you know, what happened to him. That's why I finished with that 10-6-1. All right, till next time, we'll see it until later.